Okay guys, we have a 2008 Lexus. It's a no start condition. Car got just towed in here. And uh, we're gonna troubleshoot it. Uh, first we're gonna see what it's doing. We're gonna crank the key and see what's going on with this Lexus. Okay, here we go. So that's all it does, it cranks, but doesn't start. So uh, I'm gonna put my scanner on here. And it says we have a total of three codes. We're gonna see what these codes are about. Okay, we got a heater control code. Circuit low, bank sensor one. That won't cause it not to start. We got an engine cooling temperature sensor one circuit high. That may cause it not to start. O2 sensor signal bias, stock lean back one sensor one. That looks good. That, that won't cause it not to start. Okay. So let's look at data. Complete data. Okay, so the first thing that shoots at me is that negative 40 temperature. That's not right. Either the uh, sensor went out or is unplugged or a wiring problem. So we're going to check that out first. Trae la luz, Pablo. Pablo, luz. Pablo Escobar, come on. <laughs> Mira. Okay. The first thing I see, that's the temperature sensor. It is plugged. It does look like it's plugged. Let me see what's going on. It's plugged. But as you can see, down here, the wire is broken. I don't know if you can see it, but uh, it's broken. So we're going to start by repairing this wire. And then we're going to go ahead and crank it again and uh, see if it starts. We'll do that in just a bit. Okay, so uh, we got that connector and we're just going to put some heat on it and fix it all good. So right now what we did is just put that wire back on there and uh, now we're going to look at the data. We're going to look at the scanner. Okay. Let's put the scanner. Let's the lens back on. Okay, so we got the scanner on. We gotta look at data. And as you can see, the coolant no longer reads negative 40s. It's now reading 33. So that means that the connection was repaired and it's uh, working now. So now we're gonna crank it up and See if it starts. There you go. The car started up. So the problem here is uh, the coolant sensor the wire was broken. I mean, we still got to check engine lights. We still got codes for all oxygen sensors. But that wasn't the issue why it was not starting. It was starting because the uh, coolant wire was broken. So. I'm just gonna shrink wrap that connector, 
tape it up and it should be a fix we're probably gonna recommend uh, some oxygen sensors and see if she wants to do that job uh, thanks for watching the art of automotive if you like this uh, video put thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe until next time thanks